Wow. Okay, we're back again with another epic episode for. Okay, nah, never mind. That just sucked. Okay, we're back, guys. I have something cool for you today because I am going to play a game called Solara One. It's kind of a space exploration game where you can walk over the edges of some kind of a platform that is in the sky and meditate and relax, but at the same time, it's beautiful and stuff like that and blah, 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 blah. So that's what we are going to do. I have never played this game before. I want to show you guys what it's all about. Let's hop in. Solara One. AC reality. Air conditioning reality. Air conditioning in these times would be nice. What is this all about? to the future of relaxation the future of relaxation okay let's do the jungle i guys i really don't have any idea what this game is about is it like meditation is it just exploring is it actually doing stuff doing an objective i i have no idea so yes let's travel now mm, i can hear some jungly sounds oh whoa Oh, okay, it's teleporting. Teleport travel to turn. Okay, got that. Wait, is there like a menu? Oh, here we go. No, I don't want teleport walk. Hello, would you like to walk? Oh, I have to, okay. As a VR veteran, I mean, it doesn't harm me. Okay, so we have first glimpse of an ocean with a big moon and some uh, aurora above our head and some futuristic kind of place jungly uh-huh please press the button below to call for your taxi ride to the space port sure let's go dispatching taxi now estimated arrival in 30 seconds estimated arrival in 30 seconds right a button to toggle game men menu i already did that i know that already oh i can walk okay oh i can hear something where is it oh wow we're going to fly in that thing Space taxi, cool. Can I? Oh, just transitions into the taxi. Starport, your gateway to the stars. Whoa. So this is what I was talking about. A platform in the sky, spaceport. That looks pretty cool though. All the clouds are moving. Welcome all travelers to Sky Reach Starport, your lounge in the sky. Please proceed inside at your leisure as you await your transport to outer space. Information, spaceport info, solar and one info, med meditation info. What's this? St starport info. This informational video will teach you about the starport and you will learn about the journey ahead. It will also provide key information about the Solara One space station. Welcome to oh. Skyreach Starport. Can I sit? It is a gateway to Let me the sit. stars. Let me sit. A place where travelers await transport ah. to outer space. Your journey will be on Solara One, a prototype luxury star liner. And all it has okay, to it takes too long, guys. Sorry. To I'm going to explore. May peace be with you. Oh, okay. Planet Simulator. Learn how gravity works by playing with the skill model of some planets. Oh, can I? Oh, okay. What if I do it slowly? Ah, this is like some kind of a Saturn. Oops! What is upstairs then? I guess the main content is over here. Nova Flow Space Suit. Introducing Nova Flow. As a revolution in cosmic convert carbon injected nanopolymers, adjusting sizing to any body size and allow astronauts to move and bre breathe effortlessly featuring a fully redundant life support system this suit allows you to do spacewalks worry free there's some kind of a museum or something if i if i cannot use it i don't i'm not interested i want to use it what's this solara one model this is a 170th scale model of the solara one space explorer it is the first of its kind fully automated oh it's okay so basically another info museum tour guides voice that's gonna tell me what this is about but i guess it's some kind of a uh what is it uh, iss international space station kind of thingy here we have a uh, 
Earth model. 3D Earth map. This is a 3D map, map of planet Earth. Shows the real time location of Solar 1 in orbit. Once within teleporter range, you may travel there using teleporter path on the first level. All power here, including that for the teleporter path, comes from renewable wind generated so you can travel without any carbon footprint. Sky Serenity Balconies. Relax outdoors, enjoy the view, find balance in nature's beauty. No children or infants. <laughs> what? Stay within the designated area. Your safety is our priority. Enjoy the view. Okay, so those are the balconies. Yeah, what are those? Meditation crystals. Oh, wow, that's trippy. Oh. Um. Meditation crystal activated. Welcome to this guided. Oh wow, okay. Meditation crystal activated. It looks cool though. Welcome to this breath awareness meditation practice. Meditation Find session, a huh? Position in your space, whether seated or what if I throw it out? Oh no, my crystal is gone. Just became darker. Did you guys see that? Oh my god, it really is gone. Where's the reset button? No! Okay, what is this? Another balcony, more crystals. What is this game about? Is this just meditation? Is there any action, something that they can do? Okay, are these different kind of meditation crystals? Meditation exactly crystal the same. Activated. Something's gonna happen. Finally, I want some action. I then came here to play museums. I want some action. Solara 1 Space Station in transport range. Repeat. Solara 1 Space Station in transport range. Oh my range. god, this my meteorite. 5, 4, four 3, three two, 2, 1. Okay. Whoa. What is going on? Ah, okay, we are somewhere. Oh, this is the that ISS or Solara One space station, Welcome I guess. Aboard Solara One. Yeah. We are in a stable orbit, six hundred and fifty kilometers above the surface of planet Earth. Cool. Oh, this is nice. Spacewalks, airlock, orbit, reactor, the ring, inspection, jet thrusters. Oh, it's a mu. Oh, okay, it's music. Airlock. So let's do Teleporting in three, two, one. What? <laughs> Holy sh Spacewalks are a way for passengers to experience the tranquility of outer space. Your tour is automatically guided, so there is nothing for you to do but relax and enjoy the view. Oh. It's oh. spacewalk, take the airlock. Ah, okay. So this is what they mean with the relaxation part. They just do it for you and you can just enjoy the view. Where are we now? What's this? Oh my god, I'm floating. Wow, that's surreal. I can only imagine when an astronaut is in space and just looks into the void in all directions. It's just crazy. Okay, let's return to the lounge for now. Yeah, guys, to be honest, for Quest 3 and just the, as a standalone app, this is pretty cool. I mean, if you like relaxing and meditating and doing stuff like that, being in space like this, the tranquility, yeah, it is relaxing. Oh, um, my, my battery is low. The rotation speed. Let's do it all the way. Oh, my. Oh. Okay, okay, wait. Oh gosh, that was disorienting. Even as a veteran man. Destination is press here. What's this? Please select the destination using previous and next buttons on the right side of this display. So guys, my quest headset basically died at three. I forgot to charge it again. But I have something cool that might finally help me with forgetting to charge my quest when I just put it away. So my friends here over at Binbox sent me this MetaQuest 3 
charging dock and you can directly put your Quest 3 on the dock with your controllers so that it just charges overnight or when you're done playing so you never have to worry about oh my gosh I forgot to charge my Quest I said again And it has finished charging. Look at that beautiful green color telling you it's done. So guys, if you want to get the Bimbok charging station yourself, I have a link in the description where you can get it for 10% off. So click that right now. And thank you Bimbok for sponsoring this video. Let's continue. Okay, we're back in the spacecraft, planet Thassos. Thassos 1600 light years distant is enshrouded with thick clouds of nitrogen and helium. Turbulent winds cause everlasting thunderstorms on a planetary scale. Though not hospitable to life, it is extremely beautiful to view from orbit. Saturnia. Saturnia? Are these real planets, guys? Please let me know in the comments below. Red giant Regella. Wow. Cerulean star cluster. Wow. Okay, let's go to Thassos. I'm not gonna show everything, guys. You need to explore it yourself. Otherwise, it will be spoiled, and I don't want to do that. Oh my god, I'm getting disoriented. Uh, okay, okay, start with the turning. Ooh, wow, look at that. Look at that, there's like a cloud layer or something, and a moon. Can I get... Planetary's How about this? At the same time as the formation of Hmm, let's go to the ring. Teleporting in three, two, one. So this is another <laughs> relaxation experience, I guess. Wow. Spacewalks are away. Oh, we are way further than. the tranquility of outer space. Your talk Beautiful. is automatically guided, so there is nothing for you to do but relax and enjoy wow. the view. Do you see that? There's a lot of thunderstorms going on. Wow, they modeled that nice. But I think these planets don't exist. I, I still don't know what's going on. I'll return to the lounge. Yeah, I'm intrigued by this star cluster. Transport completed. What in the world? Where are we? What is this? They're just all blue stars. Wow, okay. Let's go to uh, inspection. Teleport two, inspection. One. <laughs> <laughs> oh, here space we are. Walks are a way for passengers to experience the tranquility of outer space. So this is basically inter... How do you call it? Interstellar? The Not intergalactical, interstellar space. space because we are between all the stars the here. Ultimate relaxation experience. And there you have it, Solara 1. So it's a cool game. I mean, it's more for going through space, seeing the aesthetics of VR, exploring a little bit, but it's mainly for people that just want to take a breather, want to meditate as you have seen and be away from reality a little bit. But at the moment I expected a bit more action, but that's just me. But it's a cool experience. Definitely for new VR users, this can be an excellent standalone app that you can try out on your Quest 3 headset if you want to do what I just did. Yeah, basically that. So what did you think about this game? Do, did you like it? Are you going to try it out yourself? Let me know in the comments below. And if you're still new to VR, please check out this video right here where I showcase 10 free games that you can try right at this moment on your Quest headset. 